Welcome to a new video here in the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. My name is Michael and in this video I'm gonna show you exactly how to trigger a blood moon without waiting for midnight. In order to trigger a blood moon it's very important that you have a bow times 3 or times 5, some opal and enough stamina. It's easiest to go to this spot here, the Tanagar Canyon West Cave, which is located in this Hyrule Ridge, south of the Hebra region. Now walk inside of the cave, and if you have not yet visited this cave, it's pretty easy since at the start of this cave you have some rocks. I'm gonna show you that in a sec. You're gonna need some rocks and a high part to drop from. If you look down here, you can see that the wall is still closed with rocks. So I can do this when going down here. Somewhere further up in the cave are blue rocks, where you could also try to achieve this. Just jump down, draw your bow so you enter stasis mode and search for the opal. Remember, don't forget to get your times 3 or times 5 bow. When you get an opal, fuse it and shoot it. Repeat this with a new opal once more. 3 times should be enough, but for the better, use a 4 times. As you can see now, the game is lagging, really lagging. This gives the trigger to the game that it has to trigger the Blood Moon since the cache or the memory of the game is totally full. Open your paraglider and once you arrive at the ground, a Blood Moon triggers and it's just morning. If you think this was helpful, then please give this video a like. And when you're there, subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any other tips, hints and other awesome videos that are coming up. I also stream games such as Zelda live on Twitch. Link to my Twitch is in the description down below, so check it out. Keep an eye out that when the Blood Moon is over and you reach the ground, that enemies are appearing or reappearing and you can be attacked. I guess that's all for this video. Was it easy? Did you think it was difficult? Please leave a comment down below so I know your thoughts about it. And if you have any other ideas, please let me know as well. This was Michael signing off now. See ya.